Welcome to Cornell Cooperative Extension's Choose Local Fish, Local Seafood Cooking Demonstration videos. By choosing locally harvested fish, you can be sure that your food is fresh, indigenous, sustainable, and healthy. Each purchase of local seafood supports the economic viability of fishermen, local fishing communities, and small businesses. So let's join culinary nutritionist Stephanie Sachs in the kitchen as she shows you how to prepare this locally caught fish. So this dish is fluke in foil. It's super straightforward. And again, you can do this method with any fish. And actually you can use any kind of vegetables and herbs in a dish like this. So first I'm gonna prep the ingredients and mix them in a bowl, just makes it easier. So we're gonna have two cloves of garlic. You can bake this fish in the oven or you can throw it on the grill. So today we're gonna to actually throw it on the grill. I'm gonna do an onion in a small dice. You can use red onion, you can use scallions, you can also use leeks if you prefer. We're gonna grab that outer layer and just peel it off. So as you can see, I'm leaving an edge here. It will just make holding the onion and keeping it together much, much easier. So we have our fresh herbs. I'm gonna pull them off the stem. And the thyme you don't really have to do much with. Just wanna pull the stems off if the herbs are pretty woody or tough. Oh, the smell. It smells so good. I wish you could all smell. But hopefully you're doing this at home so you can smell. And I'm just gonna give it a rough chop like so. That's your mixture. Perfect. You're gonna take about one and a half to two foot piece and you're gonna do three of them and you're gonna put them together like so. Just like that. I'm gonna put my fish right here. This is a cool stove at this point and I'm gonna just start to layer it. So I've got three pieces here and I'm gonna put some fresh pepper. And again, you can do this with any fish. Okay, and we're gonna take some salt. Okay. And then we're gonna take some of our mixture and put some of our mixture on here. And this is ghee, clarified butter. You can use olive oil. You could also use just some butter. So here we go, follow me. And then I'm gonna layer it with spinach. So it's kind of like making lasagna, but you're doing it with fish, which is really interesting. And then I'm gonna layer more on top. Just like that and I will salt and pepper it as well. And then I'm gonna put this mixture on here and we'll finish it off because we only have two layers. And we'll put some more ghee in here and then I'll top it with some spinach. So this is what it looks like, super simple. We're gonna wrap it up. You can also put some citrus on this if you want, whether you want lemon or lime even orange. There you go. And now this is all set to just go on the grill. Should take about 10 minutes. Go, you open that up. Look how gorgeous. And then you can actually squeeze your lemon on at the end, or you can put it on while you're making the recipe. But this becomes almost like a stacked fish lasagna. 
very clean. It's delicious. So here you have it. Mm. You can really taste the herbs, which I love. Thank you for choosing Local Fish. If you enjoyed this video, please be sure to like, subscribe, and share it with your friends. Also, please check out the description below for links to more information about local fish species, more recipes, where you can purchase this local fish, and a lot more. Thank you. Thank you.